The following episode you're about to see is a mixture of satire, probably some cruel jokes and different opinions, my own. If you don't like any of this, there is no need for you to watch any further. Feel free to have your own opinion, but I will keep mine, no matter what. If you're not okay with that, please go away and die. I, I've said it before, I'll say it again. I have never had any interest in watching space nerds poke each other with their little space nerd sticks, and I'm not going to start now. You people are crazy. You Star Wars people are crazy. Yesterday I tweeted something, and all I said was that I wasn't familiar with Star Wars because I've been too busy liking cool things and being attractive. Uh-huh, yes. Um, people threatened my life. <laughs> You well, maybe it's that, that you know, so maybe not, it's, you're not really trying to like, you're not branding yourself in a way that's going to make me want to join your little life threatening club. Yeah. Did they threaten your life or did they threaten to they poke said, you with their nerd die. sticks? <laughs> Everybody's asking me what my thoughts about Catherine Timph are. Now, how do I start this? At first, I've heard about the video where she talks about Star Wars. And yes, not everybody is a fan of Star Wars. So I thought to myself, all right, she has her own opinion like everyone does. Then I saw the video. And another one not related to the Star Wars fandom issue. And another, and another, until it was clear to me that she is talking shit all over the place. That means don't take her that serious. She's against everything and everyone. Some would call her a troll. She and everyone around her even try to cover up the shit talk like it was just satire. And while we are obviously in the realm of comedy, let's talk about this. Catherine Timph. You know what? Your name is pain in the ass. So I will call you cat for the rest of the video. So you have received death threats from Star Wars fans, right? For talking shit not only about Star Wars, but the fandom itself. Are you crazy? It is quite obvious that you will get something in return for starting such a bullshit. But let me tell you a little secret, cat. No one is going to kill you by saying it. Everyone is talking shit about killing someone, but guess what? No one does. At least not Star Wars fans, but I've also heard that you've got your little sticky fingers in more than one beloved fantasy franchise. You know? Religion, feminism, that kind of stuff. And while we're still in the satire department, you, Cat, said something about doing cool stuff and being attractive? Hmm, let's see. I believe these girls think the same about themselves, and you know what, Cat, there actually are. But what does cool things even mean? Let's assume you are going to a party. And don't forget, this is purely hypothetical. And I will go to a different one. You're between the girls like you. Drinking and dancing to god-awful music, everyone is pretending to be friends while talking shit about the so-called friend not here at the time. I'm with my real lifelong friends, sitting around the table and having fun just playing tabletop games. And guess what? We stay friends after leaving. Who does the real cool stuff? What do you think, Cat? Oh, yeah, right. Nothing. You think nothing? But that is enough from me about this issue. I mean, comedy, right? So what do you think? Write me in the comments. And remember, she's just a sad, butthurt little troll.